It's good of you guys to mix it up from last game so there's no consistency. Thank you. Oh, you, you, every, you alternate every other set. Okay, actually, I can't hate on that. And he's first player, too. All right, we're ready to go. The rematch should be good, guys. I, I mean, I don't love Cloud Ditto is definitely not my favorite matchup of the game, but I had a lot of fun uh, in that winner's final set for sure. I would imagine it's just a bunch of trades, right? It can and it can't be. Sometimes, like, one cloud just has really a really hard time. Like, it depends on, like, how they're feeling and how they're moving around and playing. But we're going to see what happens right now. Uh, game one coming up of what could potentially be a 10-game set, too. Okay. So right now we got Hero on the Advent Children Cloud. That's what that is, right? I have no idea. I don't I like think, Final Fantasy at I think all. So. Oh, Final <laughs> Fantasy rules, man. Looking for the follow-up. That was a good roll-in from Hero on the Fate Cloud. Okay. Ooh, going for a down smash at the ledge. He's looking to throw him off the stage and doing something funky with him and take a first stock. Did not get it, though. It's a great forward tilt from... Wow, Heroes definitely stay warm in between these sets, which I think is, like, something that a lot of players don't do, actually. While the loser's bracket's going on, if you're sitting in grands and winners, like, you should get on a setup and keep playing, man. Keep those fingers fresh. Okay. This is just going to happen, I guess. I mean, what? you don't want to give up the stage positioning too bad. You want to keep him out there. Oh, yep, and that's nice. going to be an easy reaction. Punishes um, him using that B. Wow. Okay, he's going to make it back. And uh, right now, if you're here, you got to be a little frustrated because that definitely looked like a kill, and it just was not. Okay, down tilt in there. XL, you got to give him a lot of credit for this first stock so far because I feel like there were a couple times where he should have lost it, and he just hasn't yet. Okay, good air dodge too. Either Hero missed in there, or uh, XL just had great timing on that air dodge. I can't tell. I think he, I think he did just good timing on the air dodge, honestly. Mm -hmm. That's not going to kill him. Maybe a little bit both, you know? Yeah, that's not going to kill either, man. I'm telling you again, if I'm Hero, I'm like, what the? What's going on here? I just blew limit <laughs> twice and hit him with it and it didn't kill. Maybe he's been in the opposite side of the stage. This has been the problem. <laughs> yeah, right. And I do, I do like seeing him go for uh, the limit neutral Bs instead of the side Bs like everybody goes for. It's, it's just a great way to mix up your timing. And I mean, in a long, a potentially a marathon set like this, all the little timings and nuances you add to the move. Hero's down airs are like so it. good. Oh, wow. The nice. crowd comes alive a little bit. Hero has been. Exo's been regarded as the best cloud for a while now. And Hero's, I definitely think, either second. He's been uh, toggling between second and third for a while. Maddie G's gone a little AFK, though, so I think it's. No. Oh! I was going to say, first off, I thought that was Exo doing that to Hero. I was going to say, Exo did the hero to hero. Yeah, but I nope, it was just Hero doing the hero to Exo. Like right back at you. But. Yeah, exactly. So good stuff to Hero taking game one. Hey, that was a two stock, too. I feel like Cloud did was. A two stock isn't that big of a statement, you know, like because sometimes it's just hard to get the kill on him, especially if you miss limit or something. And oh, if yeah. he has limit, he's kind of get the momentum. It's hard. XL, let's see what he can do, man. That was super nice. By hero. Shorter ceiling, more more likely like kill off off air on the stage. So going to dreamland. Hit the double spike, man. I'm still thinking about that. <laughs> I'm not back in this match. The, way, the matter of fact, he does it twice. You don't even see it twice in like a set in general. But he did it twice in the game, <laughs> in less than a minute too. <laughs> it just shows you how well Hero knows his character in and out, and like when like Cloud, Clouds lose when they recover, right? Like that's he, he basically wins the most parts of the game aside from the recovery. So knowing how to kill him, especially something like that early, is really going to make a big difference in a set against another really proficient Cloud. Right now, you're seeing Hero kind of take over again. Uh, with these up air juggles, but XL now he's underneath him. Just a real slick fest, man, back and forth. Okay, uh, you, that's a huge thing in this matchup. You need to be able to perfect shield clouds aerials like big time. I know, you really do. I think a couple weeks ago they were doing it non stop. Yeah. But, like, this perfect shielding, their moves, is like such an important thing because they come out so quickly, and that way you can just go after them and punish them if need be. Just like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, good in there. I like that. I like that simple option by XL. But Hero, he, again, he's great with recovering and holding onto his limit. So XL kind of keeps like the simple option of like just narrowing him off and try to keep his limit and make it hit like when he's more certain it will rather than gamble. And I think that's what both these players have kind of evolved to doing in this match so far. There you go, another nice air. Nice air. Nice snare. And yep, immediately it. charge limit. I love how Hero fl uh, intentionally flew into the blast zone so we can get back to the stage faster and stop XL from charging limit. Good stuff for both players. Yeah, because they knew he was going to die. And when he yes. saw XL charge limit, he's like, all right, he's going to be dead. Let me just charge it because I know he's, he's no way he's coming back. He's exactly, yeah. Wasting his time with like using a side B and like feigning a way back is going to do nothing except for allow XL to pull further into the lead. And like that, XL has limit too. That's the thing about fighting Cloud is so frustrating, man. I mean, he gets first blood on you, he gets limit. Oh my you, god, this That spikes. was a great, great tech, though. If you get first blood on Cloud, nope. 
one little item that's so shampooy that like neutral be on the on the Ooh. so shampooy. <laughs> you can just throw it out so close range and you can't react to it at all. You almost not you never react. Attack! Wow, great ledge work right now from XL. I love the mix-ups he was doing there too. That's just cloud stuff on the edge though. Wave, I'll get to you, man. Ooh, the movement is so scary. What? Uh -huh. He spot dodged that? Are you serious? And ends it with a forward smash. That's what I'm saying, though. Two stocks don't mean that much in Cloud Dittos. That was crazy. They're both laughing it off. XL laughing. Both having a good time, man. 1-1 one, one in the set. So he upbeat and he air dodged it just on time. It's crazy. I can't, I can't believe that. I don't know if he was anticipating an, air, or an upbeat or... I, I was thinking he was going to do a fall down, fall through the platform up there, but he didn't. So XL had the heart to read the meme. Anyway. Uh, Wave, I am streaming tomorrow, so maybe we can make that happen. Let me check my numbers. Anyway, game three on Town City. Uh, XL is really good with that reverse pivot down B2. He just he just turns it. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's so satisfying seeing XL get hit by those up air strings. Same with Hero 2, though, man. <laughs> hit me that so many times. Keep me guessing with those up airs. Okay. Back throw. He tries to get him off stage. I think that's a smart thing to do in this matchup, like, because if you get a cloud off stage enough, eventually you're going to get the gimp on them, right? Even if they do recover at an XL or oh, yeah. hero level. And you just saw Hero there earlier just trying to pressure him nonstop. Even though he wasn't able to do it, he was just pressuring him with Nair's off. Like, not even off stage, but near the edge of the stage while XL was off <gasps> the stage. Oh, that's unfortunate that he'd use the limit there. But I love the idea of coming back at XL. I, I didn't expect that. I can't imagine XL did either. Maybe he did. He's going to get the last hit, which is the important one. But not in that case. He needed more damage before that's going to kill. So now you got two limitless clouds. Exactly. Limitless. Even game right too. XL's caught him a lot with that, actually, with the using uh, the Klim Hazard at a good time. Good time, and they'll be using it defensively. So. Reverse Nair is just such a cool movement and such a cool option. Safe on shield, man. Okay. Doing a simple get-up attack. This first stock is going to be really, really big in this match. And it depends on how the second stock to goes, too. Hero gets a limit after successfully landing that dash attack. This could be a really, really big limit. You want him to land that or just take the extra knockback on the up air. He can't charge limits, so he's just going to hang out. Yeah, just position himself perfectly, and he just does the up air and it kills. Okay, great use of the limit, too. He's only going to get 15% for it, but at this stage in the game, using limit to get percent is so good. The only other thing I'd say keep it for is the weight uh, and the recovery, but on Town and City, you're probably going to die early or to the next good hit anyway. Wow, these power shields yeah, come out. Yeah, those are like four power shields in a row. And another one, too. Just keep adding them up, man. They're just going to keep coming. Nice back air by the hero. Yeah, as long as Hero can keep on attacking oh, him. Oh, nice. yep. That's nice. what I love to see, man. He's just keep on attacking him for percentage. It doesn't even matter. Uh-oh. Uh, up air, and he gets to keep limit, too. So right now, interesting situation. Like, Hero's clearly ahead, but not by that much, because XL does have limit, and he does have stage control. Hero's got to come down at him now. And as you can see, that's not an easy thing to do on XL's cloud. He just needs a couple of good um, a couple of good on um, mares or just up airs and then he'll just be back in um, back in this game. Ooh, great dash attack. It's gonna force him to use his limit. Yep, because you have to fade away, cover the ledge with the nair to force the limit use. Very good stuff from here. He's playing this one by the books right now. Yeah, he almost grabbed the stage and he used dash attack off the stage, and that hitbox goes off the stage. So it, it forced him to use that uh, it brought him back off the stage and he had to use that limit up uh, upbeat. Yeah man, it can catch your head too if you're trying to poke if you like if you have a character who recovers with your head poking out over the top like Rosa. I think Cloud too actually does. Uh, it could definitely, it can definitely like watch your head, like you can just poke yeah, it and knock you off the side. Yeah, it's really good edge guarding too. Cool. I think I was gonna say I think Hero's looking for another down air. He shows me that I'm completely right by throwing it out twice. And the second one was a little unnecessary, but hey, we'll take it. And as we're talking about that, this game is even once again. Definitely, really, really close. Uh, yeah, charge the limit off the side. That's what you want. Oh, we had to use it though. Okay, not oh yeah, nair. Nice nair, limit nair, not gonna do it. Evolve oh my god, man. I saw yeah. that coming. Oh my yeah. god, that's buns. Oh, I was like. Try to avoid that, try to avoid that platform, and he just lands, doesn't realize it. It was just really unfortunate timing, because it was either that or he was going to have to jump and then probably use his limit to recover. Yeah. Obviously, that's a little better yeah, than it's more dying, ideal, but... He's, he's still in the game. But I love his idea. I think he went to fall through it, like, as he was free-flowing, but it just didn't work out for him. Looks like we're going to go to Lilat, too. This is definitely one of Hero's favorite stages. Oh, wait, did Hero take that one? Did I do that wrong? I have... Hero took that no. I'm pretty sure Hero took that one. Did I get it wrong? I'm sorry. Chat, holler. I'm mixing up the colors, man, because they're switching. Yeah, yeah, Advent Children Club one. That was Hero's game. But Hero also shook his head because he's such a good sport. He doesn't want to see that happen. Anyway, Lila, I know Hero does like the stage because <laughs> his favorite move, the down air, is really good. Because nice the punish. There's two nairs in there. Okay, nair. Yep. <laughs> 
I like the, the slide as a follow-up option, because even though he didn't land it, it put him, like, right on top of him anywhere. XL1? Oh, I was right. Okay. Oh, he did. Either way, Hero's still a good sport, man. Hopefully you're not trolling, Kumar. I won't vote for you. Anyway, up tilt through the platform. No, yeah, you're wrong, dude. Yeah. This is just that, confusing. I think Hero's up 2-1. That's what I thought. Hero's up 2-1. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Messing with the numbers a little bit here. It's, it's up with two clouds. They look identical. The skins don't even look really different. Is. It was Hero. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Anyway. I wish there was somehow like an alternate costume that didn't look exactly the same. Dude, it's ridiculous. It really is just ridiculous. Hero so 1. Thank you, Splash. So, there's so much like costume variety in this game. and Cloud does not have that. It's just if you're eating for me. So anyway, this stage, uh, XL does also like this stage. Uh, it must just be like a, like a, some kind of style choice. That was a great nair. Right, right off there. He goes for another one. Oh, Hero goes for Oh! Uh, he's good. He's not that good, though. Oh, it. falls off. This is a great... Wait, this is potentially tournament stock right here. Let's see what XL can do. Hero's got to be feeling pretty good. Using the platform to his advantage. He trapped XL up there. XL running away and trying to get this limit and close out this, close out this game so he can keep moving on and playing. Hero's not trying to have any of that, though. Yeah, he wants to go home and get his money. Yeah, I want to go home, too. I'm trying to, take, I'm trying to go to bed. Back air, Nair, trying to get him off stage. XL free falling. Wow, that must have been really scary. If I was XL, I'd be shaking in my boots right now. Not feeling good about that recovery. And throughout this set, I've been noticing him. Hero hasn't gone for a, a, a limit cross slash at all yet. He's been going for this straight up neutral B. Um, when he has limit, he just uses neutral B. Mm -hmm. Every single time so far, I've been noticing that time. He's been playing it very safe with that. Blame beam. Blame beam, yeah. So we're good. We're gonna see what uh, what happens here. <laughs> oh, bad recovery from Hero again and again. Maybe this is why XL turns the stage. Yeah, that's gonna be it. XL takes that one cleanly. Ooh, big game, big game five coming up. Oh yeah. Hero wins, he goes home a champion. Hero loses, he's got to play another five game set against a very consistent player at XL. Uh, gonna be a scary set. Uh, a, a scary game actually for Hero. Yep, take your time. That's what I would do right now. Take your time. Think about it. Take a second. Yeah, because if you if you lose this game, you got three games minimum or six games maximum. So or five games maximum rather. Six games. Yeah. Going to duck hunt. In there. Okay, right now XL is doing work, just facing these aerials and, and racking up a lot of damage on Hero. But as we've seen before. Nobody's ever done in a cloud duel. I always come back. Good, perfect shield. XL. You know what, though? This stage is looking really comfortable for XL right now. I gotta say, I do like the idea by Hero. I mean, you how could you really dislike a, you know... Okay, they both use their limits, so Hero's gotta feel pretty okay about that exchange. He didn't die yet. He's got rage. Ooh, the extended hurtbox from the duck. Or hitbox from the duck uh, allowed XL to connect that move. And right now, XL is showing total dominance uh, in this matchup. Kind of erasing those last four games. Hero's gotta find his footing uh, real quick before he loses his first stock. Down air, spikes him into the ground, does a lot of damage. Hero retreats to the tree, trying to charge limit, but you know a tree tree for cloud is usually a great place to charge limit, but against another cloud where he has the up air available to him, I yeah. don't know how I feel about that. He doesn't have to commit full fully to the tree. He just can jump a little bit, throw the up, up air up there, and he's completely safe. Mm hmm So that was a that was actually a really, really good turnaround stock from XL, and he's looking to rack it up even more. He goes for the Nair. Oh, he caught the air dodge too. Unfortunately for him, uh, Hero slips out of that combo anyway. Okay, he gets caught actually in that nair with the duck, and Hero or an XL was able to punish it. Okay, Hero's turn to go on the offense. XL turns it in his own favor again, though. A nair to beat that down air, man. Down air in this matchup's weird because it's usually such a safe move against most of the other characters in the cast, but against Cloud himself, his aerials can kind of reach through it. Up air and nair, just pretty good options against that down air. Okay, Hero's got him off the side. Hero's got to take this first stock in a quick way too. XL playing around on the tree and on the ledge, trying to just get his limit up, get it going. He's going to have to use it, though, unfortunately. That was a great nair, actually, yeah, and a nice. great side, li side B. Punish is the landing, too. Mm -hmm. The hero needs this kill so bad. Okay, Aww. he was looking for the roll. Yeah. Did not catch it. Yeah, he desperately needs a kill right now. Good forward tilt out of shield. Such a great option for clouds because it's just kind of – it does a good amount of damage and knockback. And has decent range as well. Exactly, yep. Down smash at the ledge. All right. He's not out this as well. If he, if he gets a good string of combos, he's going to be in this. So let's we'll see what Hero can do here. Definitely going to be a tough position. He's above uh, XL trying to land, and he's already at 125. 
XL's gonna get a limit before this next set is over, unless, unless Hero gets a really quick hit. Most likely, though. Doesn't have to, yeah, he's gotta use it. He, he's gotta use it now. Oh, XL going for the Nair, too. Nair, definitely a good option, as we saw earlier, to uh, challenge the limit up B. Good shield work by XL. He's just holding it, man. He doesn't care. He says, go ahead. You gotta fall back down after you use that uh, up air, so. Yeah, he's probably one up air away from dying. Ooh, oh, no, close, yeah, especially the limit. That was yeah. really close. A little higher on the stage. Okay, good shield work from Hero. Oh, that's going to tie up these sets. Bracket reset. Guys, we're in for more cloud dittos. I know everyone's excited. I know. <laughs> but for real, these have been really close matches. Uh, two great players. Both of them uh, on the rise uh, recently. So it's good to see them slug it out. Hero took a set. XL took a set. It's going to be a rubber match set. Getting right into it on Smashville. Game one of this grand final set. It's kind of weird because game one of set one, um, Hero kind of dominated that with um, the two spikes, and then game five, it was XO dominated. So kind of like a paradigm shift, in my Ex opinion. Yeah, yeah, definitely, man. I'd say that too. Oh, wow. Just throw it out there. Just mash up on the C stick, see who gets a better one, and then that's how we'll determine it. It's like flipping a coin, kind of. Like, you might as well just do it. Nice. Thank you, sir. Uh, so that's a nicely spaced back air. They both got the limit at the same time. Both hovering around 60%. Actually, dead even on the percents now, too. These guys neck and neck this entire set. And my worry was that Hero was going to fall under the pressure, but he's yeah. playing pretty, it's pretty even right now. He does a good job bouncing back, that's for sure. It's definitely something i got to give Hero. Plans the first limit, too. Not going to kill, though. That's been a big thing in the set is that it, it, really who takes the first stock and when the second stock is taken is just such a big thing in this match. Nice see eye there by Hero. Nice jabs to get him off stage. Ooh, yeah. I love that option. Utilizing there off stage, especially because he doesn't have a cloud, is so good, like you said earlier. Yeah. So good. Dude, and getting stage by cloud is just a death sentence, basically. Oh, yeah. You cannot recover at all, unless you have a limit. But other than that, you're done. And I'm liking what I'm seeing from XL, just a couple tilts, a nice little, nice little aerial string, and he's already, boom, up to 34% as Hero. You know what? Up air, back air again. The XL is uh, on point with these aerial follow-ups, man. These past two games, he's got he's. It's been a close first stock, and afterwards, he just once he takes hero stock, it's been like he's been able to get a momentum shift and just keep on racking up the damage. That's what he's been doing. Yeah, XL has definitely done a great job. If he takes the first stock, it's been you know, tough for hero to make a comeback. But right now, hero's only at 84. He gets to charge about a quarter of his limit. <laughs> a little bit of extra limit there too. XL says, "Okay, I'll take some limit too." That's the real thing. Like, no one's really winning when Limit's being charged, right? Oh, yeah. I think uh, Hero... Limit changes everything, especially at high percents. Oh, swinging with the back air, avoids it, and hits him with a falling up air. That's just basic cloud stuff. Nair at the ledge, okay. Yeah, he's going to have to use it. Nice job. XL, I think he was looking to get him with a down air if he didn't sweet spot that ledge, but he did, so. Imagine those jabs are supposed to be the other way. Again, you're seeing that a lot, is that so many clouds just... Uh, automatically throw out the down air as a defensive option. Wow, great choice by Hero coming back down with the second hit of that. And now XL's kind of on the ropes here. Yeah, basically, yeah. Well, he avoided the hitbox from the uh, limit cross slash. And nice. Yo. Nice. Steals that game. It's Mr. Steal right Your Game right ya. there. Right back at you. Hero, a.k.a. Mr. Steal Your Game, going to be taking that one. XL got the first stock, and Hero got the second stock. Like you said. Wow. wow. Stage spike for Cloud is a death sentence. Mm -hmm. And we just saw it right there. So Hero one nothing right now. We're going straight to Battlefield. As I said earlier, platforms. Oh, they both run down. <laughs> I like how Hero was the one to swing and Exo kind of rolled through looking for a more defensive option. Okay, great hesitation, actually. I love that from both players. Uh, XL looking for the shield drop, or Hero looking for the shield drop, and XL just retorting with uh, a side B of his own, racking up some quick damage on Hero. I, I, dude, I keep mixing them up too. Like, you can't really blame me for that you one. Yeah, I can't. I, I won't blame you at all. <laughs> and plus, it's kind of Thanks, like man. that thing we said earlier, where it was like a one-two thing, where like they they both hesitated because I feel like they're both reading their options. Mm -hmm. I feel like if if I'm wrong, then I'm probably if you just call me out on it. But I feel, I feel like that's what they were doing. Yeah, they were just yeah. It was just good patience. Like, well, players. Yep, I was waiting nice. for that actually. Yep, you got, you got to be looking for that one at all times. They've both been hit by it actually uh, today by each other. So <laughs> looking for those air dodges. So key. I mean, they're both so good at it. Uh oh. He's going to make it. Yep. Oh. Down tilt. That was an interesting choice. I would like to see a forward tilt. Yeah. Anything like dash or um, down tilt. Really good options to um, edge guard your opponent. 
Great job. Hero's so good at with uh, hunting that uh, tech, in, uh, tech away and getting you a grab and throwing you off stage. He, he gets a lot of good players with that, so. Uh, XL. Nice. See, now this is a situation where I'd rather be the cloud that died first. Take only 22% for your entire limit build. I'll take that all day. Oh, yeah, for sure. Now I'm moving faster than you. I got a nice recovery. I don't have to worry about getting gimped. Uh oh. Now, now I have to use it. Yeah, but I love that. Actually, that blade beam, that regular blade beam coming out from Hero is such a good option to uh, pressure XL into using his up beam. So, I do his limit up beam, sorry. Okay. Down air, XL with a definitely missed input right there. He's definitely looking for a follow up aerial. Nice gotta punish. Mm -hmm. Got to be looking for the, you got to be careful of those air dodges so there's yeah, not a battlefield. Air dodge has some significant lag and he was able to do a dash tag. Punish him. <gasps> wow. Almost got the nair, almost. That was a risky, risky recovery coming out from XL. Hero right now stuffing these down air recoveries too. Okay. And they both on limit now and back air. And one of them is, oh, I was going to say blessed, but he's not. Jabronzi. Wow. Nice. Wow. Catches him with a limit side B. Hero up. 2-0. Goes on the platform, reads him going up, and does a little cross slash. Really nice stuff from Hero, for sure. It's great to see him keep his head on straight and after losing that last set, just barely, though. And I'm not going to lie, I got worried after the game five of the first set where he's like, he lost that game pretty heavily to, um, handily to XL, and these and then I was like, you might joke this, but taking two games in a row in the second set. So um, Hero keeping composure and gaining a lot of momentum. And he's looking sharp, man. Uh, XL's definitely got a, a big task in front of him. It's going to be difficult. But... Three games is feasible. Everyone has done it before. Yeah, and XL, didn't he come back the first set? Wasn't he down 2-0 when he came back and brought a 2-2? I'm pretty it sure that's what happened. I nope. think it was 2-1, and then he won 2-3. I think so. I'm not positive, though. Don't quote me on that. Oh. Down tilt. Up. Okay. Nice patience there. I love when clouds use that as an option, right? Like, uh, just use the limit, uh, neutral B, uh, blade beam, as Lance is about to correct me, even though I know that. Uh, it just kind of defends the ledge for them, and they don't have to use the Clem Hazard up B, and it just kind of it creates more space for them rather than using the up B to uh, recover from the lower angle like that. Yeah, your opponent is for forced a shield, and you have more time to get back on stage rather than getting possibly just getting edge guarded. Mm -hmm. So okay. Like just dash tag or down tilt. This is a nice hit confirm on the jab. He's going to eat the second hit of that up B, though. Let's see what XL can do here. He can definitely. All you got to do is win one, and then the momentum's in your favor, and winning two more, hey, it's very possible. Oh, yeah. And XL, very good player. Ranked six on New England PR, I believe, so very um, common player. Not good. SD, never good in that situation. Now you gave the other cloud a huger limit. An even bigger limit than usual because guess what? He gets limit. Limit <laughs> plus rage. He's breaking the limit. Yeah, exactly. Uh oh. Not how you want to use it right there though. Hero's got to keep his composure. I, I wish he used it safely, kind of like a blade beam or something like that. Exactly. Well, and right there he died. If he had held onto it, his weight would have helped him, and he would have had the upbeat to help him recover. Oh yeah, definitely. But you know what? He's all right here. It's an even game now. The SD didn't cost him um, XL at all. Well, and XL did use his limit right there with the blade beam, so he didn't get anything out of it. XL mounts a 45% oh, string right now though. And here trying to do the same thing to him, but not able to do it. I guess I'm off stage, though. Yeah, I'm not really seeing either of them punish that come down neutral B. It definitely would be taking them to the next level in this matchup. But right now, Hero trying to close out the set, trying to win 3-0. And they both have limit. This is practically tied right now. Mm -hmm. Let's see if XL can pull this off and um, bring this to um, game Ooh. four. A little bit of a charge up smash. Both these characters at around 90%. Hero <laughs> at exactly 90. There you go, 92 on XL. On the ropes is XL. Looking um, for this limit right now is Hero. He cannot land it. Falling up there on the shield. Yeah, throws anything, it back off the side. Anything can happen right here. I'm low-key nervous and as he loses his on-limit break. Off stage, can he make him use a limit? False no. speed, I'm sorry. That's a mix up for me. <laughs> anyway, back into the match. Ooh, okay, Ooh, gonna knock, knock him away right there. It's off the stage, but make it off, make it safely. Okay, the movement right now. Limit, okay, he goes nice. for a shield there. And shields it, grabs him. The crowd gasped a little bit. I wanna see the blade beam or something safe. You can't, you can't gamble right now, especially if you're down 2-0 or 0-2 for XL favor, for XL. Uh, Hero jumped immediately right there. I guess he was oh. confident enough in his recovery. And it did work out for him. Grab, throws him off the side. Hero's only halfway to the limit. Yep, I like that. He gave up gave up charging limit and went for the nice. other side again. Yep, that was nice. really nice from XL. Going to be taking it to a game four. And let me apologize, actually. I was saying that Cloud gets weight with his limit. It's fall speed. I apologize. Two different things. So, not quite perfect right there on the analysis, but...
Ice Arrow kind of just kicking in the chat right now. <coughs> anyway, town in city. Down in town in city. Uh, okay, good. Yeah, he falls through that string and gets an up air of his own. Nice jabs there. He's off stage. Oh, not a good thing to see there. Wow. XL in a sort of <laughs> similar situation. X XL, XL just goes, I am tilting. So I'm going to go ahead and say XL is tilting. Uh, but you know what? I think he did come back that game when he, had, when he SD'd, yeah? The only difference is that he was, it was um, Hero had like, what, 90% on him? Or like 60 or 70, but like, Hero, when um, he died, like, Hero only had 20% or something. So a little bit more of a, a, little bit more of a mountain to climb, but nonetheless, he can still do it. Not only that, but now they're on Town of City where it's a little easier to die to. Ooh! So, Hero has a little bit less work to do than when they were on Battlefield for this comeback. But XL says, you know what? I made a SD, but I'm not out of it yet, man. Nice dash attack. Tries to punish the landing, but wasn't able to as um, Hero shields. Okay, that was a good nair. Get him off the side. Tries to get him with the forward air. Perhaps like the forward air spike, but doesn't get it. XL needs a kill right now. Okay. Yeah, definitely looking good for Hero. And oh! That's what I was worried about. He has, his shield was really small. Hero had a limit, and I was afraid of that. I wasn't sure if that was either a shield poke or if XL intentionally dropped it. Wow, good hit of that down air. It was put at the perfect angle, and XL all of a sudden back into this game. I feel like we see this almost every single game where it's like 70, 80 percent, and they're able to bring it back. So mm. this game definitely not over. As Exo quickly brings it back. Mm -hmm. Okay, that was a great challenging there. Look at that, Exo right he, back into it, man. And he spaced that fair perfectly. Well, it kind of faded back, used it to fair, and it was able to, was able to use it and hit it. That's, that's a big use of limit right there that we just saw from Exo. He's looking for the kill, and Hero also whiffs hit. Now we have two limitless clouds looking for this kill. Exo trying to hold on to his tournament life. Hero trying to close this one out. They're both center stage, fighting for positioning. Oh, Fair trying to challenge the dare. But great, X, great back air from XL. Sends her off the and side. Hero's blessed right now. He is blessed. So let's see if that can carry forward. <laughs> Absolutely. Dash attack, not not quite enough yet. Very, very close. Both these players almost at 120 apiece. Okay. Oh, risky recovery from Hero right there. XL does have limit. He goes to the back air. Not quite enough yet either. <gasps> Oh, he's trying to jump it with that one nom jab. Maybe he did I wonder twice. what that was. Yeah, I wonder why he didn't finish that. Oh my god, great reaction from Hero. He double jumps and air if dodges. He, if you fast fell that, he would have been over. And an air, it's going to do it. That's going to do it. Hero, great stuff, man. Held on, super clutch. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Nine game grand finals. Nine game grand finals, guys. No, you.